Hi, um, I wanted to make a quick video, it's not gonna be very long, um, it's just a quick video, it's because I just watched, um, Sean McLaughlin, also known as Jacksepticeye, go on The Late Late Show. Uh, it's a very big show in Ireland, it's like, um, like in America, going on the Today Show. It's like that big. <laughs> but, um, I like... Sean, so much. I mean, I'll never love anyone more than my boyfriend. Sorry, Sean. But, <laughs> but he deserves, he actually deserves every single thing he has. There's like a few YouTubers out there that I know deserve everything they have. And, you know, they have worked hard. They have done so many good things. And Jack is working on doing so many good things and helping so many people. And he hasn't given up on his community. He still replies to people, even though there's so many of us. So many fans. And just sitting there, you know? Sending these messages to Jack. And most of us don't even get seen. But, like, sometimes here and there, Twitter, um, on YouTube, on Instagram or whatever, he'll talk back. And it's exciting, and you get excited because this is a person you really like and you really want to talk to. And then all of a sudden, he comments on your comment or talks back to you. And it's so amazing. And I made that video singing about Jack Subtica, and I don't care if people says, say they hate it, my singing's bad, the song's bad, the art looks terrible, um, I don't have talent, I don't care. <laughs> I made it. Out of one day, one hope that Jack would see it. That Jack would see that, you know, I appreciate him a lot too. It's sort of like a little gift, I guess. <laughs> because he deserves everything he has. He's such a good man, as like just person. He's a good person. He's so happy and positive and he keeps me happy and positive. His videos make me so happy so quickly when I'm down and when I'm really, really depressed. He lifts me up pretty easily. He's so awesome and funny. And on the Late Late Show, he's so cute. And he was so nice to that girl. And he just, you know, I mean cute in a friendly way. And I mean he's awesome and I love him and in a friendly way. Just like, because he's one of the best people I know in my life. I mean, there are a lot of good people in my life. I'm not saying, you know, that, but he's one of the best. He's so good. And I don't know what he thinks in his head. I don't know, you know, he's talked about times when he feels down, but he does deserve everything he got. He's a good man. And I know he'll do great things with whatever his money is. I don't care what his money is. I don't care how much he gets every year, his salary, what he makes on videos. I don't care. He's a good person and he deserves it. That's all that anyone should care about. And I'm, I am a fan of his and I, I like love watching him so much, but I'm a friend, even though he, you know, probably, I probably will never meet him or talk to him or, you know, even get a reply on YouTube because I don't do it often because I just get nervous and I get really anxious and I get anxious at everything I do, but I pretend that I'm talking to someone in front of me. That's how I talk in front of a camera. I pretend I'm talking to my little kitten there. <laughs> I guess that was sort of who I'm talking to now, my little Thomas. But he helps me be a little less anxious and he helped me you know, want to do this, and he helps when, you know, I don't have, like, people available to help, and my boyfriend helps, my friend helps, and, you know, they can't always be around, and sometimes Jack's videos are there to cheer me up, and just his jokes, and pe what people do to, you know, accentuate his jokes, uh, <laughs> But that's not the right word, but I think people know what I meant. But it's just... I just want to express how good of a person he is. How much I adore him. And how much he deserves everything he has. And how good he is. And 
just, I know I'm repeating myself a lot because I'm just excited and happy and just, he was so nice to that girl and it was so cute. I was like, ah, I was like, oh my God, it's so cute. He held her hand to make her feel better. Oh my God, it was so cute. But he just, he is a good person. He is. It doesn't matter how much money he makes or how famous he is or how much people he has or he's been on the Late Late Show. He's still a good person. He's not snobby. He's not like, oh, I'm better than you. He's not sitting on a throne. He even expresses these things that he doesn't want to be that person. And he's constantly kept this in mind that money and everything hasn't affected his head. Do you know how strong of a willpower that is? Do you know how strong of a mind that is? And I'm not saying not everyone can do it. I'm just saying it takes a lot of willpower to say, you know, like, I'm famous, but I'm just a person. I'm famous, but, you know, I'm just me. There's just it. I mean, he recognizes that the channel isn't him. It isn't a brand. It is a bunch of people coming together to have fun. A bunch of people coming together to appreciate this one person. A bunch of people coming together just to find happiness or a lift up in their day or just something to make them feel better or good people or, you know, just a joke <laughs> or just goodness and happiness. It's a good, happy place and he recognizes that too. He may say he's not, like, smart or out of... Maybe he says it more sarcastically, but maybe he says he's not smart or he isn't knowledgeable enough to talk about things. But I think that Jack, based on his brain alone, just thinking about things, he has good judgment. And I would listen to anything he says. Pretty much. I would... I would want to, you know... I would want to listen to him. I would want to talk to him. I would want not just, just to ask him, you know, like, to sign something. If I could, if, like, every time someone gets something signed, like, if you had a choice of signing, having Jack sign something, or having Jack hug you, or having Jack, you know, um, take a picture with you, and you know how they say picture is a thousand words? I would take a thousand words. Because words are powerful. And words are lasting. A lasting memory. I would take hours and hours of time just talking with Jack. I mean, it doesn't have to... It wouldn't obviously be all at once. I don't know how long he would want to sit with me being all excited. and. <laughs> but I guess we both have a lot of energy, so we would both have to deal with it. <laughs> I have ADHD off the walls, so I would not sit down for very long either. <laughs> I would be getting up and walking around and doing things, and I would also have a lot of energy for being excited, so. But I just hope you all stay happy and you like this video.